If you are one of the over 20 million men suffering from BPH, you should be confident you can get help from your local urologist. Prior to receiving any sort of treatment for your prostate problems, you will need to undergo a standard urological examination to accurately diagnose the exact cause of your urinary symptoms. Once your urologist has thoroughly diagnosed the reasons for your symptoms, he will discuss with you the various treatments available and whether or not WIT may be an appropriate option for you. You will likely be asked to complete a questionnaire related to your general health and urinary symptoms. Your urologist will conduct a number of medical tests and will most likely use a cystoscope to look inside your urethra, prostate, and bladder. Mr. Ekinari, I'll meet you in room 8. Okay. If you choose to receive the WIT treatment, it will most likely be performed in your physician's office or an outpatient procedure room. Follow the doctor's instructions. He or she may ask you to wait or to undress. The WIT treatment is typically performed with the patient reclining comfortably on a standard examination table. Since the procedure will last 45 minutes, you may want to bring a newspaper or a magazine to read during the procedure. To help you feel comfortable, the urologist will squirt anesthetic gel into your urethra. The urologist will carefully insert the catheter into your penis through the prostatic urethra to the prostate gland. The urologist will secure the catheter inside of the prostate gland. Then the urologist will fill the thermotherapy balloon with water. You may feel moderate pressure in your pelvis when the balloon is full. If you feel the need to urinate, you may do so anytime the catheter is in your penis. A collection bag will hold your urine. Once the urologist positions the balloon and fills the catheter, hot water at a temperature of 60 degrees centigrade circulates through the balloon and raises the temperature of your prostate gland. Although this water would be painful to touch, studies have shown that the prostate gland is less sensitive to heat. Therefore, the anesthetic gel that your urologist placed in your urethra should keep you comfortable. Hot water will circulate through your prostate gland for 45 minutes, long enough to destroy the tissue that blocks the urethra. To help you urinate while your prostate gland heals, your urologist will insert a urinary catheter into your urethra. As your prostate heals, small pieces may flow out with your urine. This is perfectly normal. The size of your prostate will decrease in about two weeks, and your urinary flow should improve. After your treatment is finished, your urologist will schedule a follow-up visit when he will remove your urinary catheter. Once your catheter is removed, you should be able to return to a normal schedule for urination. Look at all the toys they got over there. Look at that. Okay, here we go, downstairs. <laughs> okay, go play, Christopher. I'll see you later, pal. I'll be right over here on the bench. After the procedure, your prostate and urethra may swell. So follow your urologist's instructions about when your catheter can be removed. While your prostate heals, you should plan to take care of yourself. For a few days, urinating might be somewhat painful. Your urologist can prescribe a pain-relieving medication. If you see a little blood in your urine or semen, don't be too concerned. A little bleeding is common during the first few days after treatment. Infections are unusual, but always a potential concern when catheters are inserted into a patient. Any fever or abdominal pain associated with the need for frequent urination should be reported to your urologist. If a urinary infection does occur, it can be treated with a course of antibiotics. Due to the safety of water-induced thermotherapy, Patients have not reported the long-term complications associated with other surgical treatments. However, post-procedure complications are always possible. Should you experience any unanticipated problems, please contact your urologist for further evaluation.
You have seen how a new treatment called water-induced thermotherapy, or WIT, may help resolve urinary problems from enlargement of the prostate gland. Water-induced thermotherapy for benign prostatic hyperplasia is a non-surgical, true outpatient procedure. It requires only topical anesthesia from lidocaine gel. The single 45-minute WIP treatment produces a predictable result that increases urinary flow and improves urinary symptoms. WIT enabled me to get my old lifestyle back again. And if you are suffering from BPH symptoms, check with your urologist to find out if WIT could be appropriate for you too. <laughs> hey, buddy. I'm driving the stove. After all, there's too much to do in life to have BPH problems slow you down. Should we get some lunch? Let's go. All right, off we go, pal.